Hi guys, today we're going to be doing The Shape of You by Ed Sheeran. I've simplified uh, the song quite a lot, so we're going to be breaking it down into three parts. That will be the, um, the keyboard melody, then the chorus melody, and the bass line. And it's really nice if you've got a friend who can play with you, and one of you can play the bass line, and the other... Uh, the melodies. Okay, so the first melody goes like this. This is the main recognizable melody of the song. Okay, and I'm going to be using the one finger per fret method again. So first finger, first fret, second on the third, second fret, third on the third fret, and fourth on the fourth fret, although we won't be using your fourth finger this time. Okay, so we start off with the open B string, second string. You go to the third fret on the B string. Back to the B string twice. Back to your third finger. Back to the open twice. Back to your third finger. Back to the open once, second finger, open B, second finger on the third string. Okay, so open once, third finger once, open twice, third finger once, open twice, third finger once, open once. Second finger, open second string, and second finger on the third string. Really slow. Okay, you don't have to play it as fast as that, so you can build it up whatever feels right to you. Right, for the next part we'll do the chorus. This is a simplified version, as I said earlier, I've simplified the song, so it's a bit easier to play because it's quite a complicated melody and it goes all over the place. Um, so this is like the essence of the song, essence of the chorus. So let me play it for you. Okay, so that's the kind of basic idea of the chorus. If you play that to people, they'll recognize it, I'm sure. So we start with our third finger on the second string. We go to the open first string. Second finger on the first string. Back to the open first string. Back to your third finger on the second string. So that's okay. Then to your open first string twice. Okay. Okay. The next bit is similar. Similar. There's four phrases to this and each is quite similar. The next one you start with the open second string and back to your third finger. Open first string. First finger. Ah, second finger. Open. So that's Look at 
that again. So from the beginning of the chorus. Okay, then we go back to the third finger again. Open first string again. And this time we end on the open second string. Okay, second part being. So up to now the whole chorus is. Now the third part, which is very similar again, this time you start on the third finger like you did on the first part, first, third finger on the second string, open first string, second finger on the first string, okay now we change it slightly and we go to the open second string, so it's Third finger on the second string. Open first string twice. Okay, so that third part is. Chorus from the beginning of the chorus now is. And then the last part is the same as the first. Sorry, second part. Okay, just to try and unconfuse what I just said. Third finger here on the third str uh, second string. Open first string. Second. Open first string, third finger on the second string, open first string, and open second string. Okay, so the beginning of the chorus, I mean the whole chorus, the beginning to the end of the chorus. Okay, the third part of the song is the bass line. Uh, as I say, it's nice if you have somebody, a friend who's playing along with you and they can play the bass and then you can play the melody and swap around. Um, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense just to play the, play the bass line, but it's, as I say, it's fun with somebody else. I'm going to play it for you with the bass line and the first keyboard melody, just so you can hear what it sounds like. Okay, so obviously you don't need to play both at the same time, just so you could hear what it would sound like if there were two of you playing together. Okay, so second finger on the fifth string, string. <laughs> three times. 
open sixth string. Okay, you're going to do the same three times on each note. On each, there's four notes. Third finger on the sixth string. And open fifth string. Okay, so all together. Okay, and there you have it. Um, hope you have fun and hope uh, this was helpful in learning the song.